Hey Pioneers, my name is Jay Moreno. And mine's Carolina Perez. For today we have Josiah and Anthony with student interviews, Sports with Angelese, and Staff of the Week with Geo. This, this is, is your, your Pioneer, Pioneer Report. Report. I'm Josiah the Cruz and you are? I'm Camille Samron. Camille Samron. What breed of a cow is black and white? Holston, Jersey, or Angus? Um, Angus. Mm. Holston. Oh. <laughs> I need to sneeze. All right, who am I here with today? Ingrid. How many stomachs does a cow have? Four. Correct, they have four. Thank you. What is the primary purpose of a cow's horns, Miss Clark? Protection. Yes. Tehun Park. How many stomachs does a cow have? One, two, three, or four? Four. Correct, it has four sections. Thank you. I'm Josiah De La Cruz, and you guys are? Uh, Evelyn, Daniela. Daniela and Evelyn. What do cows drink? Water, pina coladas, or most of all, milk. Uh, I'm saying water. Um, when they're born, they drink milk and then water. <laughs> Why not pina coladas? Cause that's weird. All right, I'm here with Chisholm. What do cows drink? Water, milk, or pina coladas? I think the correct answer is pina coladas. <laughs> Wrong. It's milk. The girls' bathroom is clear. I repeat. Still. Hi. I'm Josiah De La Cruz, and this is Estelle, my best friend. And basically, cow questions. What cow is most commonly known for being black and white? Me. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. An Angus, a hostel, or most of all, a cow. A cow. I'm here with. Kyle Bell. When was the first cowhide game played? A long, long time ago. You gotta guess a year. Mm. It was in the 50s. 1956. 55, you're close. Thank you. Do you know that cowhide is tonight? Did you get your tickets? No, I didn't. Where can I get them? You can get them on GoFan, but now with sports interviews. I'm here with Jose Cantu. How do you feel about going into Cowhide? Uh, I feel great. I feel like we're gonna get the win. All right, that's good. Um, how do you feel like? How do you feel after you lost the game? Uh, I feel a little sad, but I feel like I just need to bounce back harder. All right. Your mindset going into the game? Uh, my mindset is just play as hard as I can and to get the win. Right. Thank you. I'm here with Talon Zong. And how do you feel about this being your last game? Uh, I feel I feel happy, but I also feel kind of sad because this is my last game. This is gonna be the last last time I, I'll be stepping on our home field. But this is gonna be light. You guys think you're gonna win the game? Yeah, I think Redwood ain't really ain't really nothing for us to be scared of. They're not that good, so we 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 gonna be all right. My right, big stepper, big stepper. All right, do you guys have like a punishment? Like if you guys lose the game, like coach gonna make you like do some drills or something like that? Nah, I wouldn't think so. I think we we've been good enough to to get away from the punishments and just just keep winning. That's pretty much what it is. I feel that. I feel that. So what's your mindset going into this game? Uh, win. You know, just play. You know, coach be telling us play four four quarters. So. We do that, we're gonna win, play as a team, we're gonna win, just do us. That's right, four quarters make a dollar. Here to interview with Damien Soto. All right, man, how do you feel about this being your last Cowhead game? See, yeah, honestly, I feel really good about it because it'll be my first and my last Cowhead game. Oh, but yeah, yeah, my, first oh. my first one, I'm hearing all the hype about it, so, you know, looking excited for it. Mm, I feel that, I feel that. Do you guys think you're gonna win the game? Honestly, if we work together as a team and not individually, we can honestly, we can win the game. Mm, teamwork means a dream work, guys. All right, what's your mindset going into this game? My mindset going into this game is to is to run through anyone that gets in my way. You know, try to sack the quarterback as much as I can and put pressure on him all night. All right, what position did you play? I played DN. Oh, uh, for sure, for sure. All right, all right. So, what specific song you like you putting on to get hyped up? I'll be putting on to get myself hyped. Can't be touched by Roy James Jr. Oh uh, yeah, I don't know that for you. Uh, 
Do you have a favorite memory from this football season? And so what it is? Uh, my favorite moment of this football season is being able to meet all the guys out there. You know, my first time coming in, they all showed me love. And that's what it's all about out there at football. You know, we big, we big brotherhood out there, you know, family. Yeah, everybody big. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite celebration after taking down the QB? Uh, the, taking down the QB, I hit my little celebration. It's like this, you go. <laughs> that's my celebration. I'll be you. Uh, thank you, man. You're really good. Thank you. I can't wait for this game. Me too. I hope we win. Sad this is the senior's last cowhide. Good luck to everybody. But Redwood. On the staff of the week with Gio. My name is Gio. I'm staff of the week. I'm here with Miss Perez. How has it been preparing for cowhide? It's been really busy in advanced class. Um, you've been in there. We have had a busy October homecoming. And now Cowhide, we've been prepping the football players to do the intros. We did that yesterday, Monday, and we have been filming our segments. And then Friday, we have a full day of rally and then filming the whole event in the afternoon. Are you excited to see the finished results? I am. So I actually started editing the football player intros, and it looks really, really good. The vision that we had in mind is coming out, so it's really cool. What are some words of encouragement for our team? Um, I think you guys are doing so great. This is a big uh, game for you guys, right, because of the playoffs. This decides playoffs as well. <laughs> Giovanni! <laughs> I shook my head. Is that not good enough? I'm here with... Mrs. Johnson. Mrs. Johnson, how have you been preparing for Cowhide? Oh, it's been a lot of work. We worked in Saturday and Sunday of this last weekend and daily, and we've had great support from ASB, Link Crew, and Avid, and some families even have come down and helped us prepare for this great event. Are you excited to see the finishing results, how everything turns out? Absolutely. I think that each day that we've had our dress-up days and participated, and when kids came onto campus on Monday, they're just excited to see that excitement of the great cow hide with all the cow spots. Each day we're revving up enthusiasm for the game on Friday. What are some words of encouragement for our Mount Whitney football team? It's really stay true to what you guys have been doing. It's been working. Week after week, they're out there doing, bringing home the W's. And so I just encourage you to stay true to what you guys have been doing. Thank you for representing our school, the whole coaching staff, as well as the entire program. Thank you, Pioneers. Thank you, Ms. Johnson. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to buy your ticket. Make sure to dress out and count for it. Subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos. And follow us on our social media. Until next time, this, this has, has been, been your Pioneer, Pioneer Report. Report. Boo! Oh, where you can get the tickets at? You can get them on GoFan. Is that like For GoFan? Like, is that GoFan.com, .co, .gov? Just GoFan. Just GoFan. And then you like, it's the first link that pops up. Just GoFan. I'm so excited for the game. I can't wait. Oh. Quiet on set? I'm not involved at all with this school, though. There's helmets all over the building. Well, yeah, but like... Okay, we're just... We're just doing it for the script, Miss Perez. That's the joke. That's the joke. I go from not knowing to being all out in gear. Yeah, that's the joke. How are you tonight? Did you buy your tickets? Okay, we're like, we're just off the doming this. this we're natural. We're <laughs> Literally, Miss Perez, we off don't gotta follow a script. Quiet on set. Okay, I need to start unpinning my shoes. Amaze balls. Should we just like go up to the camera and go move? Just be like right in front of it? Yeah. Wait, where do I go for it to go? Just in front of the screen. Wait. Okay, right Move. Move. No. Move. No. No. Gotta go. Skirt. I can't. I can't do that. <laughs> My pants are coming up, and they're already so short. 